Okay, so you just talked about how Christians are afraid to know stuff. Sometimes they are. Because they don't want their Christianity threatened. Yeah, sometimes we by can't. By knowing more science. Sometimes we can be that way. Okay. So, if a Christian was not afraid okay. and wanted to learn some science, <laughs> yeah, how do I know what science to believe? Mm -hmm. Like, if I was a a uh, little podunk nobody that got into, you know, made a volcano in science fair in sixth grade. It right. was like, Mom, Dad, I want to be a scientist. And then right. I went to college and took science courses. Uh huh. How would I know what to believe and what not to believe? Okay. Well, I think, all right, for just on the... You know what I'm saying? Yeah, I mean... Because I'm going to get thrown a bunch of science at me. And some of it's going to be faith, I suppose. Yeah, I think I think the the biggest thing is going. All right, so let's let's take biology for example. Okay. Okay. So you're going in. You're a biology major. Mm -hmm. Okay. And so you're going to be learning all about the human body. Okay? Sure. And so you're you're studying about the human body. All right. I would take everything that is fact. Everything that's observable, fact that is known, I would take it. Mm -hmm. Okay, even, um, yeah. <laughs> I don't think you want to go e there. Even a uh, <laughs> uh, <laughs> fact. Okay, I'll take it all as fact. <laughs> I guess I won't go there. All of it's fact. I would. Okay. This is why I'm asking the question. <laughs> Here's what I'm saying. <laughs> If it's observable fact... Are men women? <laughs> <laughs> All right. Is this the question you're asking at this point? No. Oh, thank God. I'm just... Oh, okay. I'm asking I'm asking the question around it. Okay. So I'm going to science classes. Right. I don't know anything. Right. And I'm learning from S people. Right. How would I know right. that that scientific uh -huh. leap of fact isn't true? <laughs> <laughs> okay so i think all right i mean we, what you're getting down to right mm -hmm. is all right okay we're all like on a biological level obviously there's things that we're going to learn about genetic code that we're going to learn about cells that we're going to learn about dna mm -hmm. right all of those things we, you can learn and yep. that's awesome yeah like learn those like you'll understand those things okay okay the issue <laughs> Mm -hmm. Yes, the, the issue. The issue that you're bringing this up. This is the question. The question is, mm -hmm. so, but if I have a, if if there's a professor mm -hmm. that is pushing an agenda. Or putting, if there is a professor that is putting faith, is presenting faith as fact. Right. How do, would I know? Because I would often go, well, where, like, when they're saying it, where does, what is their source? What's it coming from? From what they've seen, observed, or is it a theory? Is it a theory? Okay. Like most of them are labeled as theories, right? Like the it, like, okay. So Richard Dawkins, who I've been bashing this whole time, is actually like on the like on just a he's a he's a biologist. Okay. Yeah. He's an evolutionary biologist. That's who he is. Uh huh. And in for Dawkins, man's a man, woman's a woman. Okay. All right. And that's faith for him observable <laughs> fact. Okay. Okay. All right, we just got flagged. Yeah, we probably need to leave that whole thing out. Um and so <laughs> No, but this is the point though. Yeah. Like this is the question. Right. Like how would I know? How would Yeah. And I and I do think that If I didn't know anything and I just went to college to learn sure. science. Sure. How would I? I think you've got to be really clear. Like, tell me what. Tell me how to filter. Yeah. <laughs> well, I think it's. I mean, I think you've got to be really clear on what's scientific laws, mm -hmm. right? What has been actually scientifically observed that like you see it scientifically, not theoretically, not philosophically, mm -hmm. not I wish it was this way. And I think that's how you're able to filter the. The filter them. Now, I say that I've not gone to school, right? Right. As a biology major, but that's what you would say to me. 
But if you were going to school, that's what I would say to you. And and I would also, I mean, I would take what you're, you know, take what you're learning and go find other colleagues and talk to them about it. Right. Okay. So, um, I, there's, there's a, there's a, a young lady that I've mentored and biology has been her major in college. Okay. And so there were times where she would be like, Hey, this is what I'm learning. Cool. Cool. Mm-hmm. Right. And Are then, we uh, good. Yeah. Am I still Christian? <laughs> and, <laughs> and, and I don't think it was that difficult for her to discern between what is fact and what is theory. So, uh, yeah. So right. Because dumb people aren't going to be able to understand science anyway. So if I'm smart enough to learn science, <laughs> I should be smart enough to know what is actual science and what is. Yeah. Or what's fact or what's and what's fact theory. and what's faith. Yeah, and what's what's just a hypothesis. Cool. Yeah. All right. And I'm not downing every hypothesis in the world either. Right. But I'm just saying, but we have to all I'm asking for is to Because God is a hypothesis. All I'm asking for is to call it for what it is. Right? Faith. If if it's it, yeah. If it's a hypothesis, call it a hypothesis. Okay. If it's a theory, call it a theory. Don't put more on it than it actually is. Okay, yeah. so if I believe a theory, that's faith. Yeah, unless that, yeah, because it's until it's proven as fact, it is just a theory. Faith. Sure. The the it, belief it, in the theory is faith. Faith. Yeah, I mean, and you may even okay. say it's a reasonable theory, right? Right. You're jumping because it's a reasonable claim in your mind. That's fine. Okay. But still understand it's it may be reasonable, but it's still okay. Faith. So. <laughs> so okay. So if I if I believe any theory that isn't proven scientifically, uh huh. And I meaning I have faith in that theory to be true. Okay. Does that detract from my faith in God? No, not nec- okay. Not necessarily. Okay. Because, I mean, I think a lot of us have faith in things that aren't God. That aren't God. Okay. That doesn't detract from our our faith in God, right? Okay. Like, all right. So, a couple weeks ago, I'm on an airplane. Mm-hmm. I've got faith that that airplane is going to get me from the country mm-hmm. I was in to the country I'm going to. You had faith in God to guide the airplane <laughs> safely to the ground. <laughs> I to, could or to uh to guide the pilot's, pilot's hands hand. right in order to safely land <laughs> us on the ground. Or or I could say it as I have a reasonable mm-hmm. right faith that the mechanics and the pilots and all the individuals involved mm-hmm. with getting that plane from mm-hmm. point A to point B is going to do so. Right? And at one point someone had a theory that people were gonna be able to fly. Mm-hmm. And they had faith that that was going to happen. Mm-hmm. And then it came true. And then, and then they stopped believing in God. <laughs> and now they think all the Christians are stupid. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, sure. <laughs> all right, I'm picking up. I'm picking it up. I'm getting there. <laughs>